I recently had a client ask me about leveraging a 1031 exchange. I thought this is a great topic to explore, especially because you might have the same inquiry on this topic. Hi, I'm Natasha Carroll, your local Houston, Texas realtor. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so that you can catch our latest videos that we release weekly on real estate, Houston, or the Texas market in general. In the world of real estate investment, the 1031 exchange is a powerful tool that can provide significant advantages for investors. This video that we're creating today, I hope that we demystify the concept of the 1031 exchange and explore how it is leveraged in real estate and discuss the pros and cons associated with the strategy. You may ask, what is a 1031 exchange? A 1031 exchange, also known as a like kind exchange or a tax deferred exchange is a provision in the U.S. Internal Revenue Code that allows real estate investors to defer capital, gain taxes when selling one investment property and acquiring another property of equal or greater value. The term like kind refers to the requirement that the properties involved in the exchange must be of the same nature or character rather than identical. Leveraging a 1031 exchange in real estate, there is the tax deferral. The primary benefit of the 1031 exchange is the ability to defer capital gains taxes by reinvesting the proceeds from the sale of a property into a new one. Investors can avoid immediate tax liabilities and potentially grow their wealth through continued investment. There's the portfolio diversification component. The 1031 exchange allows investors to reallocate their investment portfolio without incurring tax consequences. This flexibility enables them to adapt to the changing market conditions, explore new markets or property types, and improve the overall diversification of their real estate portfolio holding. There's wealth accumulation. By continuously utilizing the 1031 exchange, investors can compound their wealth over time. The deferral of the capital gains tax allows for greater capital reinvestment, potentially leading into increased cash flow, property appreciation, and long-term wealth accumulation. You may say, what's the pros? Tax deferral, of course, help you avoid immediate capital gains tax payments and preserve the capital for reinvestment. There's portfolio flexibility, uh, you can adapt and diversify the real estate holdings according to the market conditions and investment goals. There's wealth growth. Leverage the strategy to compound wealth through continued investment and potential property appreciation. But then there are some cons. There are strict timeline. There are time insurance associated with a 1031 exchange. Investors must identify a replacement property within 45 days of selling the relinquished property and complete the exchange within 180 days. There's a like kind of requirement. The property involved in exchange must be same nature or character, including the flexibility to switch property types. There's a potential higher basis. When utilizing a 1031 exchange, the basis of a new property is carried over from the relinquished property. This may result in higher tax liability when eventually selling the replacement property without utilizing another 1031 exchange. The 1031 exchange is a valuable strategy in real estate investment of offering, of course, tax deferral, portfolio diversification, and wealth accumulation opportunities. But leveraging this provision, investors can optimize their investment portfolio, defer taxes, and potentially achieve long-term financial goals. However, it's essential to consider the strict timeline, lifetime requirements, and potential tax implications associated with the 1031 exchange you must consult with a tax professional and a real estate advisor. It's crucial to fully understand the intricacies of the strategy and so that you can make informed decisions that align with your individual investment objectives.